Seven News has been given exclusive access to one of the largest new developments in southeast Queensland. A massive man-made lake will be the centrepiece of the $590 million community on the Redcliffe Peninsula. It's set to be the jewel in the crown of Newport. This is the foundation of a 22-hectare man-made lake. Hard to believe this is only the halfway mark. Since we commenced work in 2015, we've carted 2.2 million cubic metres of dirt on site. Up to a thousand dump trucks of dirt a day. It's put to good use, redistributed to help construction in other parts of the site. Surrounding that lake we do have lakeside parks, uh, we've got a retirement village, we've got a retail neighbourhood centre and we have a diverse range of housing. Families are flocking to the area. We've looked at the future, like the whole plan that was coming together. We knew it would be an amazing place to live. We welcome around about three to four families a week at the moment and continuing to grow. The new lake will form the community's central feature. It's being built in two halves. The first will be completed later this year. When the dig is complete, the lake will be filled with two billion litres of seawater. To put it in perspective, that's a thousand Olympic-sized swimming pools. It'll happen over a three-week period. We'll open the lock and weir. We'll start to pipe in water. Land further from the lake starts at the $270,000 mark. Waterfront home sites start from around $592,000. Perfect for some stand-up paddleboarding or kayaking in your front yard. You can also plan a little bigger. Yeah. We'd like to get a boat. Yeah. Yeah. Wouldn't we all? Chloe Bailey, 7 News. A man with a chainsaw has stripped off, smashed his car and then attacked it with a golf club in front of horrified shoppers. Perth police pulled tasers on the 27-year-old before charging him with possession of ice.